Hello there, fellow gamers, and welcome back to some more Super Mario 3D Land. Today, we are gonna tackle World 3 3, and we'll and I'll also be trying to finish the rest of World 3 up, and that is just three more levels, so yeah, probably get it done by the end of this week. So, yeah, let's get started. All right, it's full of donuts. It makes you hungry. Uh, excuse my finger, because you're gonna need a Tanuki suit to get the first star coin. Because right over here is a turntable, and turntables in this game you must use a Tanuki suit. to turn it. I don't know why, you, you just do. Um, so here is your first star coin above Mario's head, apparently. Right over here. And because I accidentally stuffed up the recording, this is a second take. I think I told you in the last part, and yeah. Ooh, star. Just bad. My my thumb is slipping on the C pad. Oh gosh, my thumb is slipping. Extra life. Checkpoint. Now you can either take the risky course or the easy course. Well, oh gosh. Well, just flutter your way to there and wall jump using your mad skills. Second star coin is over there. Wait, am I saying star coin? <laughs> I'm saying star coin again. Arr! Anyway, turn right over here. He will throw out the third star medal and it will appear over there. And slow down. There you go. Warp block. And skedaddle, because these donuts will fall. I don't know how they float, actually. You know, sometimes you wonder. Why do donuts float in midair? Eh, it's just Mario physics, I guess. Can't, can't blame gravity. Can't blame anything. It's just, it's just how Mario rolls. Okay, so that is World Three Three. Next time we'll be taking on World Three Four. Thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed. It. Click the like button. Hit the subscribe button. Do whatever you want. So yeah, I am the Fizzy Gamer and I'll see you guys next time.